Weather coverage you can count on with meteorologist Olga Breeze and the Way 31 Storm Tracker Early Warning Radar Network. Certainly is a quiet night across our region and these temperatures are dropping. Notice how many 50s are showing up across the board. We have clear skies and calm conditions, but it's going to be a chilly night tonight, especially if you're making if you're making that early start tomorrow morning. Right now, uh, upper 50s to lower 60s in a few locations. But again, clear skies and winds fairly calm. For most of us, though, it's going to be an uneventful night. I do expect these temperatures to uh, hover right around that 60 degree mark for several hours before dropping. But notice our dew points are very, very low. So the temperatures in the 50s are feeling fairly comfortable right now for many of us. The dew points, I do expect the drier air to stay in place at least for the next several days, meaning that it's going to be hot, but at least it will be comfortable. For many of us, it's going to be a pretty decent overnight period tonight. I expect the radar to stay quiet and also the uh, temperatures to bottom out. It'll feel a little bit cool for the morning. However, we'll warm it up tomorrow afternoon. We'll see temperatures back into the 80s and I'm tracking low humidity for just a couple of days and even um, low rain chances for the next stretch. So that could be a good thing if you have those outdoor activities planned. Overall tonight, 55 should be our temperature close to that 5 a.m. mark and then tomorrow another spectacular day. It will look a lot like today. We'll bring our our sunshine back. We'll see temperatures in those middle to lower range 80s and gradually our temperatures are going to increase back toward our normal high of about 89 degrees, 88, 89 degrees this time of year. Future radar will show you the timing of maybe some of these clouds we might be seeing over the next couple of days. I call them fair weather clouds by Tuesday afternoon and evening. It should be a nice calm and quiet night. But when we move into Wednesday, we'll start to see a little bit of a wind shift. Winds become more south, southeasterly. That's going to bring in a few fair weather clouds more than likely across some of our north northern counties, but that will spill into portions of North Alabama as well throughout the late afternoon and evening. All is clear by Thursday morning, starting off with cool temperatures and sunshine, but slowly humidity creeps back in by Thursday afternoon and evening. Once we move into that seven day forecast, you'll really see the changes toward the end of the week. So enjoy those fall like uh, morning lows in the 50s for the next couple of nights by Thursday, transitioning back into those upper 80s with plenty of sunshine, but Friday we could see a high closer to that 90 degree mark. It won't feel too hot, but it'll feel a little bit warmer than what we've been uh, seeing for the last couple of days. The good news is that the weekend next weekend looks fantastic. We're forecasting dry conditions and plenty of sunshine. Stay with us. We'll be right back.